action. All right, let's welcome to Bentley's World. Excuse my attire. I have been working out here since 7.30 this morning. I'm getting it done. Welcome to the beginning stages of Waterland. I cannot wait to share with you guys what I have going on. And yeah, let's do it. So, over here, I'm building. Oh, mm -hmm. I have been working out here since 7.30 this morning. I'm getting it done. Welcome to the beginning stages of Waterland. I cannot wait to share with you guys what I have going on. And yeah, let's do it. So, over here, I'm building. Oh, mm -hmm. <laughs> See, this is why I need to make pussy, pussy expensive again because, yeah. It's working, she just get up. Okay, so what we're doing with this property is we're turning it into like a makeshift adult playground. So the construction is gonna take four days. Um, what I'm doing with the perimeter of the fencing is trying to catch my breath y'all that was a pretty, pretty pretty stiff tumble um so what i'm doing with the perimeter is you want to always gauge your space when you're doing these type of events because you don't want any dead space so what i did to counteract the dead space is basically build my own perimeter around the property geometry you know some of you people know that some people don't it's okay it's okay but we have a pretty good solid team back here. They're working. What they have to do is they have to go all the way around first. And then they're going to do netting. It's going to say water lane 13, et cetera, et cetera, out here. You know what? I'm going to wait until y'all about that. But come on. Come on. All right. Um, let's They couldn't really get it the fuck right, so I had to come do it my mother's like, okay, watch. So, one thing about me, I'm never gonna wait for anyone to do something for me. I, I'm, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. This is, I'm never gonna wait for anyone to do anything for me. Uh, oh! Did I forget to say that? Ah! Bro, did you get that? Put these two down. Because I'm a person with my imagination, if I want to build clouds, ground levels. Yeah. Clouds. 
So your your dream was to have it from here going all the way to the All the way over the comforts of the house, clear top, just in case if it rained and we could lights in it and um, so forth and so on. But I feel like it would completely defeat the purpose of doing that if we're going to just scatter tents and then of course the aesthetics of the water barrel. No. Right. But, right. but if you guys want to possibly just look at the site map and see if we could kind of like maybe have two alternatives, that could be one. But again, that falls into the line of, like you said, the grounds, hitting gas lines, etc. cetera. Right. With 48 hours to do it. So I think that we should just maybe just pump the brakes on it. Okay. 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 What well, do you think? For future, for if future. you want us to look at something like that, mm -hmm. we can definitely, you know, look at the areas. Right. You have so many different areas that you can right. definitely put okay. different, okay. Um, separate. Okay. Get it for you. Okay. Oh, and can you introduce yourself and tell everyone who you are? What do you do? <laughs> Where does this go? <laughs> Oh, I have my own television show. Oh, you do? Yeah. <laughs> well, hello, I'm Belinda Cortez, and I'm an event consultant with Peerless Events and Tents. Okay. <laughs> hey, I'm Freddie. I'm the operations manager of Peerless Events and Tents in Houston. Houston. Scott Norton. I'm the general manager for Peerless Events and Tents. It's your Houston. time to shine! <laughs> 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 okay, thank you guys for coming out. Oh, well, you're very you welcome. But nice um, to meet can you. I have your business the yeah, business card? Because I will have. And we are day two of the world and making Waterland. We have the main stage being eclipsed right now. One second, money calling, money calling. All right, so we are day two of phase two of Waterland, okay? Um, I'm back out here again. I guess I didn't learn my lesson from yesterday, but this today I came with a t-shirt. Okay. How you feeling? What you doing? <laughs> That's not funny at all. But so today what we're doing up here is we're putting in the swags. We're standing above the Garado. This shit is about to be fucking insane. Where we're standing right now, we're going to have fire show, marching band. <laughs> oh, no. Um, so as you can see back here, you're wondering, maybe wondering what this is. Phase three. So well, let's go out and let's get on some people's nerves. So, as you see right here, we have the walkways beginning to be put up. This is going to be covered in sand. I have sand that was imported from Cuba. <laughs> Custom fine grain sand. Kill me to sand. Alex and Boozy are over here whispering. Bullshit. Oh, what are y'all talking about? We're talking about your LED wall over here. Okay. So we're talking about the LED wall. We're talking about your luxury restroom. Ah! <laughs> oh. Okay, guys, this is some good shit. This is a sneak peek. You know that this is not a regular event. We don't do porta potties, okay? Let me show you what. Let me let me take you on a look on the inside. This is the man behind the magic. <laughs> <laughs> so oh. I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna on. give you a sneak peek. Well, it's not a sneak peek if I'm showing you. So hey, whatever. Let's look. One, two. Ah, ah. Okay. Oh. How nice. Do you see this? Do you see this? Do you, where am I? Del Frisco. Where am I? Oh. Nope. Backyard. <laughs> Normally AC would be going, so it would be nice and 
cool when you walk in. I love Trevor. Money well spent. Yep. Okay. Money well spent. Yep. You have a radio station preference? Huh? You have a radio station preference? Hip hop. Hip hop. Pretty urban people here. So, <laughs> which uh, hip hop station? 979. 97.9. If you notice in the backyard, we have a natural state of wildlife. We have our own peacock. Now let's not get too close because they are wild. But there you have it, folks. Hey, tell the people who you is. This is AJ, formerly known as. I'm not playing with you today. I'm, I'm AJ Vazal, and this is my brother's birthday, and we're just trying to get it cracking, and we're just trying to. Turn up one time. <laughs> Waterland exclusive. Oh. I, I'm trying to figure out what's step and repeat. He keep on saying step and repeat. So, I don't even come outside. So like, I'm about to be outside this weekend though. I'm gonna turn up one time, only for my brother. <laughs> hey look, but a step and repeat basically is a red carpet backdrop. But we're gonna put this on, we're gonna take it up a notch and we're gonna put it on a stage with an LED, life-size LED board. So people won't be able to have their phone. So, we're gonna give them photographers. We're gonna have photographers here. I thought you were doing that on that side. No. -uh. I thought you said it was gonna be like I was behind gonna, the lion when the I lion. Was. He got a whole lion coming that's gonna jump out, and if that lion bite me, I'm gonna bite it back. I'm gonna tell you that. It's virtual. <laughs> It's a virtual line, guys. <laughs> no one will be harmed in the creation of this project. Please don't. <laughs> and we don't have no insurance. We got people signing waivers, so you better have your own insurance. And you coming at your own risk. If you've been the one to We're going to edit We're going to edit that, guys. Fly, bone pig. And a bone pig. Right. Yeah. Black can't swim, so can I wear my life vest we'll, we'll, on top? On no, ma'am. Unfor unfortunately, pretty hurts. We will have lifeguards on deck. But I can't swim, so can I feel safer if I had a life jacket on me? Uh huh. So I can wear a life jacket down the slide. Mm mm. I can't breathe. Really... It's okay. It's okay. We have life. This is a rare, rare video. Of me. Zone. I was operating this yesterday. <laughs> Let me start with the accent. I was operating, oh, see, you know, that's what I was trying to accomplish. But uh, from the video, y'all see. <laughs> I need a little bit more work. This is where I spend majority of my time throughout the day overseeing the project. Let's take a look at the project. This is from this angle. You see that this is not mediocrity. This is not mediocrity. This is a project. I am putting my, my blood, sweat, and tears here. Yeah. Um, but yeah. So, um, so guys, that is the end of phase two today. We have another truck with sand coming in. Really, really interesting. We have the Drake. Um, the swags are going in today, but I am so excited to bring you out tomorrow. I have about five more hours of work to do today. So I have to get off the camera and stop playing and I will tune in tomorrow. <laughs>